You know, you don't have to go across the ocean to serve people in a very poor area. The Rosebud Reservation is the second poorest county in the United States. And so to have an experience of serving the very poor in our own land is, I think, a very important experience for dental students. The population is predominantly American Indian. They are members of the Rosebud Sioux tribe. They are looking for a dental home, and the St. Francis Mission Dental Clinic has been providing that dental home for them. The patients here are in great need of dental care, alleviation of pain, treatment of dental decay, and of gum disease. The reason I decided to come on this service trip was the opportunity to meet some people that are in need of our services, help them out, and then also to gain a little bit of experience. It makes me stop and remember, you know, it's for people. That's why it's important to go on these trips, I think. Giving back to the community and serving back to the community is a, a crucial part and really important part of being a Creighton student. What we hope this opportunity for the Creighton students will provide them is uh, first and foremost real life experience in comparison to dental school. They do not have two and three hours time to identify what they're even going to do. This is a real life situation for them. So one of the, the fun aspects of this trip uh, over and above serving uh, our patients is the bonding that happens between students. We all live in a guest house provided by the St. Francis Mission and we, pr we uh, create our meals there and, and evenings we uh, sit around and, and talk about uh, the day's activities, uh, tell stories and have fun and, and uh, enjoy our time together. As far as bonding with my classmates, uh, five hour drive will do that pretty well. It's really great. Uh, you get so busy in school with classes and other requirements clinic. This is a, a good way to get to know people that you might not normally talk to and uh, just connect and um, hopefully develop some deeper friendships. The message that I would like our dental students to take away from this experience is that need is around the corner, that it is not difficult to integrate uh, service to mankind into a busy practice and uh, personal life and that patients greatly appreciate everything that you do for them. My hope for the dental students, the faculty, for our community here is that we will establish a kind of partnership and a, a connectivity where the people who serve here and then leave here, the students and faculty, will continue to keep us in mind and tell others about our needs and that the people here will reach out and share the rich culture of the Lakota people with those who are visiting. Hopefully students will see that they can integrate this type of service into their practice um, when they get out of dental school. Being exposed to this community will help me in the future because that's where I'm going after I graduate. I'm looking forward to helping people in rural areas. A service opportunity like this is right in line with the Jesuit values to put others first and, and service first and to help your brothers and sisters that are in need. I think this is the perfect opportunity to put those in action.